teeny, meeny, miny, mo. <laughs> what you doing, Toku? <laughs> Top of the morning, friends and family. You can tell I get in a late start because people are already up doing things. Kids are going crazy. Kids are driving me crazy. Kids have been driving me absolutely nuts the last couple days. Like, nuts! yeah, like endless screaming. I, I swear, you. Like you're just, this, this is what's been happening like 24 7 around here even when they're sleeping they're screaming. It's ridiculous <laughs> Are you sad? You got to put some pants on if you're coming with me T. You got to put pants on, okay? You, what, what's all over your face ding dong? I'm going to Whoa. Are you ah! <laughs> Hey Eli What? What? You know. I know. Dragons. Ooh, what about dragons? That um, they have wings. They have little points on their wings, and they have fire, and they have teeth, and they have horns, and they have four legs, and. They have a pointy end at their tail, and that's all I know. <laughs> well, it's a lot more than recently. I'm leaving the. Um, I'm and also, not all dragons have fire. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Yep. Uh, I'm leaving the white balance on automatic today. God, boy! Jeez. I'm leaving the white balance on normal, or not normal, but automatic, just to kind of see what happens. Let me know if you can even tell the difference. Also, uh, please smack the like button, whack it, touch it, tickle it. L let me know how it, how it treats you down there. We'll get this video started off like that. I'm just gonna, I got stuff to do down in the snake room today, so I figured I'll just bring you guys down here and, I mean, I always have stuff to do in the snake room, but I don't always spend a whole bunch of time down here with you guys. Or do I? I don't know what I do anymore. I'm just trying to normalize my, my vibe. We fed Halo a big fat rabbit last night. You can see she just spread blood all over the place and it's just a mess in there. And I, I think that uh, what I'm gonna do, well, this is what I usually do, is I, I don't bother her afterwards because she's got a big fat rabbit in her. So I give her some time. And then once she's done, I'll clean up her cage. Once she's done digesting for a good 24 hours or so. We've got to wait to. We got to let her digest her big rabbit a little bit before we pull her out. Okay. We get out, walk, Sam, the lizard. But I'm busy. Here's my example of Hillary. I've got work to do downstairs. Okay. Okay. Let me send the kids with you. Oh, she's now awake. Hi, Roxanne. Hi, Roxanne. Is you awake? Roxanne, Dad, Roxanne. I'm gonna help her get her shed off, Daddy. Wait, is her shed is off. But I thought there's a little more. Nope, she's good. That's what I can? Yeah. Oh, hope there's a little more shed. So it's also, we've been getting a late rain here in California, this late May rain happening. So I figured, why not throw some snakes together? And right here we've got Oedipus with the queen. And look what they're doing. They're locking up. Who wants to see some uh, coral glow clown pides? That's what I've been shooting for for years. This may be the pairing that makes it happen. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. O'Malley's. That's my buddy Matt Garibrandt. Matt's actually got a pretty cool YouTube channel. I'll put a link down in the description for him. Feature a friend as we've been doing Consistently now for the last four videos. I think we're consistently doing consistent stuff. Finally finally consistent after years of YouTube We're being somewhat consistent Matt actually sent me this Desmond Decker record at one time And he's he's got a cool channel. You guys go check him out. Uh, he's really into short tail pythons and He's consistent on his YouTube channel. So I'd, I'd highly recommend going to check him out and uh, yeah Yeah, Can you do that do that for me, please, please. I've got lots of requests for you guys you guys got any requests of me? I will, I will gladly, I will gladly leave a comment down below. Leave me a request. I don't care what it is. 
but ask me to do something. Go ahead, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you want me to do. I just might do it. I probably will. I'm, I'm open to doing lots of things. I'm, I'm just like that. While the kids are tending to Roxanne the Tegu over there, I figured I'd bring out Roxanne the snake, our big hypo berm. And while I've got her out, I want to let you guys know that our podcast, Searchable as Reptiles, that I've been doing with my buddy Garrett Hartle over from Reach Out Reptiles, uh, I made a YouTube channel and we started recording our podcasts on video and Garrett actually shaved his arms on the video and there's lots of other kind of funny shenanigans that happened visually on the podcast so I thought we should really start a YouTube channel so we could uh, start it. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, there's a link in the description for the podcast YouTube channel. You guys want to go check it out. It will probably make your day a little better. Just like Roxanne makes every day better for me, don't you? Don't you? Whoa! I made it turn on the light. Uh. <laughs> I turned on the light. <laughs> okay, good job. That's hard work. Did I do good? Hey, Lemon. What do you know? I know. Noah? No. Noah. Noah? Yeah. What about Noah? Um, crazy. He's crazy? Yeah. Yeah, Noah is crazy. What else about Noah? He screams. He screams? Yeah. Yeah, he does scream. Yeah. Very loudly. Yeah. Can you tell me anything else about Noah? Toys. Huh? Toys. Toys? Yep. Noah has toys? Yeah. Does he share his toys with you? Yeah. Oh, what a good brother. Yeah. Eli. Eli? Yeah. yeah I, I play with him. And good. me. And you? Yeah. Yeah, you're Leia. Yeah. And Daddy. Daddy? What about Daddy? That's your purple. Yeah, that, that's my purple. <laughs> yeah. That's your hair. I like purple. Yeah. We all get colors of the rainbow, too. Okay, and I have two. Uh, no, that's a big user. Uh, uh, you suck. Does it see you get that door? I got you one. So I thought that Candace here was going to be laying eggs anytime soon, but apparently she was just going into pre-lay shed and those little ovulation moves and, and moving the eggs around getting them into place was me mistaking her for just getting ready to go into pre-lay shed, not what I thought. So anyway, she's in pre-lay shed now, so as soon as she sheds out, maybe another month or so, we should have some Enchi Cinnamon Sunsets with all luck possible. Yes, luck. Thank you, please. Yes. No, not in that water, T. Please don't put your hands in that water. Okay. I guess this is going to be kind of an update video on some animals around here. That's what it seems to be turning it out to be. I had no plan when I picked up the camera. I was just like, I should pick up the camera and, and probably record something. Just because, uh, well, that's what we do around here. Honestly, there was part of me that didn't really feel like doing it, but I was like, well, sometimes I end up recording some pretty cool, fun stuff when I when I don't feel like doing it, so I do it anyway. And then it turns out to be okay. But this is this is Sangria, our blood python, who I also thought was maybe gravid this season, but maybe not. May ooh, ooh. Eli closed the door and she got a little bit scared there. Say hi, Sangria. Thick snake. We like thick snakes around here. We like our snakes thick. Mmm. Okay, let's let's leave her be, Nati. Okay, I'm gonna give her a break. I think she's kind of tired of kids. I think she's feeling a lot like me today. Hey, how about another update? GHI, Mojave, Pinstripe, possible extreme gene, het clown. <coughs> Bless you, T. I know which one. Her name is Make. Make Make. She named after one of the dwarf planets. The boys named her, 
And uh, she should be ready to go next season and probably produce some of my favorite looking clowns, GHI Mojave no, clowns. And, uh, I want to hold one nake. You want to hold one nake? Well, here you go. Here you can hold one nake right here, okay? Huh. Ooh, careful. Okay. Oh. And we're all done. Oh, uh, yeah, she's a good snake. She's putting up with a lot of stuff, just like me. She's still working on it. She's only two. I think she's doing pretty good. You doing good, T? Yeah, you, you're doing too good. Better than most two-year-olds out there, I bet. She's gonna be the snake ma steak master around here. And of course, Sunset here, our indigo. You got her. Two hands. Spread wide apart. Stay standing. Ah, uh, come on, T. Pick him up, pick him up, pick him up. Come on, get your hand down here. Get a hand down here. Come on, right here, underneath here. Good. You're doing good, T. Are you done already? Yeah. Okay, that's the last snakey, okay? Okay? <laughs> the snake, guys. Yeah. Yeah. I'm putting myself in the complaining corner because uh, I really just want to complain about myself. I feel like I should be better at. Can I? Can I just? You want to sit here? Yeah. I've just sometimes I lose my patience and I I try really hard to be patient, but it's not always easy for me. And I'm just complaining. I'm gonna complain about myself. I don't. I need to work on being more patient. I I need to. I don't know exactly how to do it other than just practice. But I know we all lose our patience from time to time. But man, when I do it, it just it gets me. It gets me hard. I don't like to lose my patience. But I do it. Time and time again. Throughout throughout my life. Lost my patience many times. The solution. Stool. T, you gonna sit on the solution stool with me? Be my buddy? Alright, buddy. So, how is daddy gonna work on not losing his patience? By thinking. Oh, by, by thinking? I'm sitting. You're sitting? Yeah. Oh, just sitting. Maybe if, when I'm losing my patience, if I just sit. Sit and breathe. It's working, see? It's working. Now check, check this out. I've been freezing this entire freezer worth of ice, because I'm trying to make these, oh! Ah, I just lost my patience again. <laughs> Hillary recommended that I just go out like in nature somewhere and, and do some of the editing I have to do. Just like in the back of the car, just park somewhere and I, I think I'm gonna do that. I think that needs to be done. Let me show you guys something first though. I've been freezing this entire ice chest full of ice because I'm making clear ice. I've been really into making old fashions and stuff recently and I found this video that showed me a good technique for making big clear ice cubes, so sometime this evening this should be ready to pull out of here and if you guys are interested in seeing what i do or if you already know leave a comment down below and uh, i'm i'm pretty excited i get excited i get really excited over seemingly trivial stuff like this like you know just some some clear ice like what's so exciting about that but for me i, I get really excited about it get your coca blocks pepper jack pepper jack pepper pepper jack ah! ah! all right here i go bye Welcome to my new office. I'm doing work. I came to a beautiful place to get some work done and uh, and try to chillax a little bit and get my mind back together. And I'm gonna get this, this work done. I'm gonna work here on the computer. I just recorded a Cusco Uncut that you guys probably saw already if you watch all the videos. I also did go to the store, which was a lot of fun. Uh, really missing things like going to the store. I got these fantastic glasses that I'm gonna pair with that ice block that I showed you later tonight and uh, have myself a good old time but I think I realized that it's it's coffee it's coffee that's got me all strung out and I'm gonna I'm gonna cut back on the coffee I think so but I'm gonna get this work done for the next couple hours enjoy this then we'll get back and see the family and uh, honestly I feel I feel way better already having just vented on the Cusco and cut and 
having this space to just kind of get some work done without people screaming <laughs> will be nice. So I'm gonna get it done guys. See you in a little bit. All right, that's enough work. I think it's time to go back home. Uh, now the coffee's wearing off and back home, I, I'm actually feeling way better. So much better. Let's go see if Noah wants to tell us what he knows. What do you think about that? Really? <laughs> We've got a coop, but <laughs> these guys, it's just not quite ready to go outside, I guess. Boys, your guys' room is absolutely destroyed. Yep. What do you know? I know. King Cobras. What about King Cobras? That they are, mm -hmm. that their venom isn't as dangerous as other Cobras' venom, but, well, it is just not the toxin. The thing that makes their venom more dangerous is they have bigger amounts of venom. They're a type of snake. They're cobras. They're the biggest venomous snake in the world. So they're the biggest cobra in the world. Like all, re like pretty much all reptiles, they have their split tongue and are they real cobras? What? Are they real cobras? No. But they do have the hood. And that's all I know. <laughs> I think I realized one of the huge sources of my frustration and lack of patience is that I'm trying to learn the song called The Entertainer. You probably heard it, Ice Cream Truck play it back in the day maybe. And it Maybe it's the fact that that song has been stuck in my head since I was a kid, but I've never actually been able to play it, and it's actually really, really hard. Probably the hardest song I've ever tried to learn on piano, and I've been working on it, but I have to play it super slow, because like, it's both hands are doing two different things at the same time, and it's just like, I mean, I learned the right hand pretty good, I've learned the left, left hand good. Putting them together, it's actually my turn. So, you rec you'll recognize the song. Well, it's, So that isn't so bad now, that all that, that did take practice to do the yeah, double yeah. finger and then you got the left hand at that same time is going like. You know, you know it's, it's a lot, it's a lot. And I'm trying to put it together and it's taking me so long, it's super slow, it's like. You, you see, it's like you have to do all the, this hand's bouncing over here like this, this hand's bouncing over here like this. I'm gonna get it. Whose turn? Me. Who, your turn? Yes. No, it's my turn. My, my turn. turn. My turn. My turn. My turn. My turn. My turn. Thank you guys for joining us for Cinematic Snake Saturday. I uh, apologize for my somewhat bipolar mood going on today. I mean, that's that's kind of how it felt. Clearly I've got some issues I need to work out. I'm working them, I'm working them, I'm getting there. But uh, hey, wanna see those ice cubes? Pretty clear cube, not too shabby. I didn't follow the instructions to the T. I think next time I will, but that's still not, that's not bad at all. If you want to know how I did that, I, I'll find I'll link the video below that I that I used to make it. And uh, yeah, you guys take care of yourselves, take care of each other. See you on the next one.